Hey guys, what's happening? So, I was browsing Amazon the other day, and I was looking for a uh, three-jaw chuck from one of my indexers. And this time, actually, somehow, I don't know if it was a sponsor link or popped up, but um, it was like half price. So, it's a... Uh, it's a Minty Toyo dial indicator, and but it's only $51 on Amazon. And... You know, the first thing I thought of was probably the bootleg, right? But it came from the Mitty uh, Toyo store. And, yeah, this is kind of like some other guy took a picture of that, too. But which is odd. I think this thing says 2046S. And this one says this is the new improved version of the 2046S. Um, but, you know, got tons of five-star reviews. Um, I'm hoping this is not a bootleg, but... I mean, I'm made in Japan, but that could be bootleg. But for <clears throat> this thing, was slashed down. It was normally like $106, and it was put a link, link down below where you can get it, but at least the link where I bought it from. Um, but it was on sale for like half price, slashed for half price. Okay, so this is smart. I thought it was. For some reason, I was thinking it's bigger than one of my other ones, which is cool. But I, have, I do actually have another base coming in, too. For this, Let's take a look at this metric. Um, all my dial indicators are metric, pretty much, because um, I mean that's kind of how I think now. Like I design everything in metric, so all my CNC stuff is a metric. I'm not sure if that's like an adjustment point or what that is. Okay, has like this amount in the bottom. Um, so it's each of those, each little line tick is 0 0.01 of a millimeter. It feels buttery smooth. Yeah, it feels really good. No crunchiness at all, like super smooth. So I'm hoping this is the real deal. I mean, maybe if you guys are Minty Toyo experts. Um, certificate of inspection. Yeah, this came from the Mitty Toyo store, so I'm assuming that's a real deal store. Not they sell 100% knockoffs, but lots of five-star reviews. One guy with a one-star review said it was a knockoff, but I would say 99% are five-star reviews. Okay, well, oh, there we go. That's cool. Those are little dovetails. So, like, a dovetail would be, like, for this mount here, I could connect it to my dovetail. Um... I do actually have like an other kind of base coming in, so I wanted to get like a third base, one with the more up and down like wireless, not wireless, but the, the solid post. Just so I can get some different angles in. You know, because I already have these two. $51. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have bought it. Um, you know, if it wasn't $51. I mean I have other things I got a lot of other things I gotta buy for CNC stuff. And I didn't really need another dial indicator, but you know, for a Minty, Minty Toyo, if this is actually legit, 51 bucks. So I'm guessing that is, that's one millimeter right there. So this is really small increments. And then, as you can see down there, the little dial down here, like one, two, three, four, five, six, eight. So that's a 10 millimeter, well, a little bit over 10 millimeter range. All right, I like it. All right, now I don't have to be embarrassed about my dial indicators anymore. <laughs> All right.